This is actually one of the most amazing uh, customer which I am using right now based on Android 14. I'm just going to share with you my experiences about this custom room and by the way unfortunately it's not available for much devices as far as i know this is available for me 11x poco f3 redmi k40 but the thing is i'm just sharing with you my experiences and uh, i will let you know that which are the features i am loving right now in android 14 custom rooms so stay tuned and make sure to watch this video till the end it's based on android 14 so that's one of the best things uh, one of the great things about this custom room is the settings ui as you can see settings ui is looking so unique i use a lot of custom rooms right now not every custom room brings you this kind of ui very few custom rooms are there which brings you this kind of beautiful ui in settings and this is one of them we are talking about ghost os and it's available for poco f3 mi 11x redmi k40 as i just mentioned if you take a look at the settings ui this is actually looking a bit card style ui but also the home screen ui is a bit changed here if you take a look at the default launcher default launcher as expected is changed and it's not the pixel launcher this is one of the best launchers i've ever used it is launcher 3 base having all the useful features all the useful things you need in a custom launcher already present here some gestures options are present app door customizations icon pack customizations recent span customizations almost every customization what you need in a custom room in a default launcher already present here if you take a look at the quick settings panel one thing is the data usage as you can see data usage is looking something different advanced data usage some features are available in android 13 based custom rooms but if you take a look at android 14 based custom rooms not every feature is present right now but this custom room brings you almost everything that is why i'm using this one and this is why i'm just loving this custom room so far it is also having the light quick settings panel if you use the light mode if you use the dark mode things might be changed here for sure i mean some pixel based custom rooms brings you dark quick settings panel doesn't matter if you use a light mode or dark mode lock sync locks are also available so in case you want to change the lock sync lock you can do so sometimes i use this analog clock if i love this one because analog clock looks good and including this one this also looks good too it depends upon you if you want to use them or not it already brings you some lock sync lock styles by default you can go and explore them some icon pack customizations font customizations and icon shape options are already present here and as expectedly no face unlock right now i tried every 114 base custom room so far the face unlock option is not present in any other custom room right now while making this video it's not implemented yet but other options are present here here are all the customizations which you need and almost every customization is present because it is this is still in initial stages so not every customization is present but still a lot of customizations are already included so that's good let's have a quick look at all of those customizations which are present here the features which are present here in user interface you will notice the floating rotate button which you can enable or disable some ui styles all the pre-built themes which you have with which you, which are available in some of the customizations some of the custom rooms already navigation bar style customizations fonts customizations which were kind of expected icon pack customizations are also present signal icons data icons wi-fi icons icon shape every useful thing which you need is already present here including this thing if you move on to the status bar customizations you will notice we have the option for clock and date customizations you have the option for battery styles and one of my favorite which is ios 16 style battery indicator is finally available here and this custom also brings you the status bar padding adjustment i use this feature this is one of my favorite features i use that thing if I move on to the volume panel styles, you will notice some options available here. We have gradient style, we have shaded layer style options present in volume panel, rise, real me UI, there are many options available for you which you can go and explore, in call vibration options are also present here. Including this, in miscellaneous, you will see game space as expectedly. Hide developer status is so useful feature. All the spoofing options are also present like unlimited photo storage and the Netflix spoofing and the ignore secure window flags option is present here for you too. All the useful things, all the useful customizations, feature, everything is already present here. Quick settings panel having the same features and the quick setting panel styles. For example, the one I'm using right now is surround. You have the option for thin line, which is like this one. And we also have some extra options available like outline, two tone ascent and many more, which you can go and explore. 
these were things i just want to let you know thanks for watching i will see you in the next one until then goodbye and make sure to subscribe this channel